Horus. Hello, welcome, Vamagila Gila. You are always welcome here. This is your Lionese Tarot Tracks pull for the week of October, starting the 9th to the 15th. There is, we have the Friday the 13th, this coming Friday, and we have an eclipse. It's a new moon. The moon will be furthest away from the sun, so it's an annular eclipse. It's, it won't cover the entire sun. So we have these two popping out for Taurus, the Empress, we are. Or you have the abilities of the Empress. Em Empress, you, have, you are royal. And you know there will be delays. But there's this knight coming in with this message. Maybe it's a lawyer. Something that has definitely come to a point where something must be said and done with the Empress. What more? This is the message that's going to come in that's going to completely change everything in your life. Nothing will be the same from here on, Taurus. Nothing. It will be a complete catastrophe out of your hands. There will be nothing that you can do about it. There's nothing you just be forewarned. And unfortunately, you're going to be depressed. You're going to be looking at, but what? look at all this hard work and all this love that I wasted. Don't be so sad. You do have a little bit left that is still yours. You have something left to salvage, which is your own courage. And you have the courage to get through anything, any disaster, any catastrophe. Very heavy eclipse. I mean, not just for you, Taurus. It seems everybody's going to be affected by this eclipse. Remember, this is an adults only channel. If anything resonates with you, I'm glad. If it doesn't, lose it. You do have the two of spades, which is your first warning. Someone is definitely going to come in and cheat you. So you just watch out. It's related to money. Maybe it's unforeseen charges on the internet. Credit card fraud. Or definitely a personal betrayal. Somebody is cheating on their husband or some wife is cheating on their wife. You know, as things go. Oh. And it is definitely upsetting the balance in the card. But with the moon, your creativity is very high with the three of hearts, telling you that you will be successful and you should write a symphony, create art, gardening. It's great for business, maybe a love affair. Happy for travels. And the six of no, mm -hmm. the nine of clubs. You have independent success. All your problems are resolved. So stop listening to others. Think for yourself. Trust your intuition. Following the crowd only gets you average results. Act on your own for extraordinary success. Now, unfortunately, Taurus, I've got two very dark cards for you. The Eight of Cl the eight of Spades, the tells of sickness, plagues, injuries, viral infections, and it could be fatal, but luckily there is modern medicine. It could help. Seek your medical and professional. 
for seek your medical professional for help. But warning, a warning, this is a disease on its way. Take better care of your mind and your body. Oh, please, Taurus. But with the ten of spades, there is great sadness six, <laughs> mixed with tears and disappointment. Not only bad, but poisonous like jealousy. It counteracts the good effects of the cards around you. You may be overcome with dread. You want to be left alone. The warning here is to not get addicted to your very own sorrows, Taurus. And I know you like to hang on to your sorrows forever in a day. But let's see what more these cards can tell us about this. someone who tends to teach you on your creativity and your independent success. Why? Is there sick, more sicknesses and plagues coming your way and you're feeling very depressed? Well, there's all the spying that's been on going on around you and you, your, your, your page of swords that's been working so hard, working so hard with the Ten of Wands to bring you down and this rain down is a very heavy load on you. And it breaks your heart. Complete, this, this is a complete heartbreak hotel show. This is about jealousy and deception. And frustrations in love. And everything else in life. So you need to step back with your nine of wands. And take a look. Is it also important to carry on fighting but when you step back you see a better point of view maybe you even need to go into hermit mode and pull away and think and unattach yourself from everything go some need some soul searching there Taurus because you have this choice ahead maybe in love maybe in work maybe in your health whatever choice that you're going to make should come around to you because all that hard work pays off and the king of swords might be penning at this agreement for you of full contentment with finances and just complete perfection at the end of the day. So hang in there, Taurus. Because you are the light at the end of your tunnel. Life gets tough. But we all get smarter. And if we try harder, life gets better. Vamo Gila Gila, you are always welcome here. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you haven't yet subscribed, please hit the little bell for notifications. If you have, I thank you very much. And if you care to share, I would love it if you dare. Tot ziens. Salane gachle. Shalom. Salam alek. Ek is lief vir jou. Hamba gachle. Sia bonga. Yala bocha. Tschüss. Tot ziens. Ich liebe dich. Mm -hmm.